Hey, Liam Ward here at LearnTheHarmonica.com. It's Western Week, and we are playing the streets of Laredo. Don't go anywhere. If you enjoy this lesson, please click like, share with your friends, and subscribe to my channel for free harmonica lessons every single week. So the streets of Laredo today on a C diatonic harmonica, this is great for all levels from absolute beginner because there are no bends, nothing complicated about it, it's just a case of trying to get the notes. So it's a brilliant song to practice for getting your notes in tune. As it's Western week I did have a look for a cowboy hat but I couldn't find anything so unfortunately I'm just as usual. Um, Let's have a look at the tab and uh, I'll play it through for you first so you can have a look at the tab as I play it and then we'll go through each line bit by bit. Okay, so um, I did some extra techniques in there, tongue slapping and, and uh, tongue blocks and octaves, but they're just kind of extra fancy bits to add on top, um, just for the sense of the performance. We're going to look at the basic tab, which is just going to be single notes, and then uh, you can look at my other lessons on tongue blocking and slapping if you're interested in that stuff. So we've only got four lines to get through. Uh, I had a good listen to the song and each verse was practically the same in terms of melody so basically you can apply this one verse to uh, or this one tab to all the verses. So I'm taking the first verse as our template if you like. So the first line is as I walked out uh, in the streets of Laredo. So. So we're starting at six and working our way down to three. It's a nice little flowing melody. And we've got six blow twice and then five draw. Five blow, five draw, six blow, five draw, five blow, four draw, four blow, three draw, three blow. So it's got that kind of descending down the lines like that. One little thing to be aware of, the way I've uh, tabbed it out is uh, using I having two notes as I so if you're getting I mean I've tried to line up the tab so it isn't confusing but if there's any confusion the, there's one extra note in terms of notes per syllable because I is two syllables when you sing it uh, excuse me Now I've listened to a few different versions of this. I'm using the Marty Robbins version as my basis, but the uh, rhythm, if you like, the swing on some of the notes and how straight some of the other notes are does vary ever so slightly, but I'm kind of loosely basing it on the Marty Robbins version. So um, I was just thinking w with some of the later lines, da, 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 they kind of do that. Whereas in the first line, he kind of goes, as I walked, instead of da, da, da. Da, da, da. Anyway, <laughs> I'm probably confusing you, um, but I was just trying to uh, justify the fact that I might be uh, inconsistent in terms of the rhythm because I've heard lots of different versions and I think it being such an old uh, tune, there'd be different ways of playing it. Anyway, that's our first line. And then... As I walked out in Laredo one day, my voice is hurting. I did six gigs over the weekend, <laughs> ah, and I'm in the studio again tomorrow. <laughs> Crazy. Um, so three blow, four blow twice, and then four draw, five blow, five draw, five blow, four draw, four blow, four draw. Okay. And that actually takes us halfway through this uh, verse. This next bit I like because it jumps up an octave from the three blow to the six blow. Uh, 
Now, again, some versions of this I heard it didn't do the uh, I spied, I spied, kind of the jump up. Um, it would just play, the, it would just do the same note uh, up there. Anyway, so we've got three blow, six blow, five draw, five blow, five draw, six blow, five draw, five blow, four draw, four blow, three draw, three blow. So you'll notice it's very, very similar to the first line. It's just that we're doing that starting on the three. If you can tongue block, it's quite useful at that point to actually lip purse the three blow and then tongue block the six blow. Because you can get there quicker and quite accurately. It's pretty tricky to it's doable and uh, you don't have to tongue block, but if you are a tongue blocker, that's a useful thing to use. So, uh, and then our final line, wrap, wrapped in white linen as cold as the clay. So again, the version I used was just wrapped in, whereas some of them seem to say wrapped up in. And that will be our final line. Da 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 da. Okay, let's have a go at playing that in full from the top. I'm going to count us in on four. One, two, three, four. Okay, how did you get on? Hopefully okay. Please leave your comments and your questions and queries about this song, about other things, and I take requests on my lessons as well. So you can leave your comments beneath the video. You can also email contact at learntheharmonica.com. You can find me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram as well. Just search Learn The Harmonica on those platforms. I hope you've enjoyed looking at this lesson with me today. If you have, do click like, share with your friends and subscribe to my channel for free harmonica lessons every single week. I will be back with another lesson very soon. Until then, enjoy your practice and I'll see you again soon. Cheers.